Does it bother you that uh, Griffin has been picked off in training camp yet? Does that bother the defensive backs or something? Somebody brought that to my attention. Um, I didn't. I actually hadn't realized that until about yesterday. Um, I mean, it's good for the team. Um, it's it's sort of frustrating. You, you obviously you kind of feed off of big plays as a defensive back, so um, you you kind of need those every once in a while. Uh, the fact that he's kind of not providing those for us, it just means we got to work harder. Really, um, at the end of the day, it's 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 better for the team, but it just means we. We have some some work to do uh, as a defensive backfield and as a, a secondary. Is it asking too much for so many young guys to be in starting roles? Uh, I don't think so at all. Um, if you if you really get to know uh, some of the guys that you just mentioned, um, I would say that we're all very mature, very hardworking guys. So um, what we lack in experience, I, I feel like we make up in our in our work ethic and the time that we put in because. Um, myself, along with those other guys, we this entire off season, we've been making sure we've been doing all the extra work, putting in putting in the extra time and, and unturning, overturning every stone to make sure that we're as prepared as possible uh, going into the season for not only for ourselves and this defense, but for the team as a whole. There's no substitute for experiences. So um, I'm cherishing every opportunity that I have on the field, every rep that I get in practice, whether it be individual drills, whether it be team drills, uh, seven on seven. Um, I'm always trying to make sure that I'm making the most of those reps to, to be productive on the field.